Welcome back to Kick to it, buddy! Welcome back to the studio. And JD, no, JD. JD's over there. Yeah. He's back in the studio with us. This man never gets off work. He has to take care of his mom. And he's back in the studio with us. We've got our producer, Ma- the mask, the mask producer. This has nothing to do with coke. <laughs> the mask producer. It's just, like, it's just like that TV show, the mask singer, whatever. Yeah, well, just like that. And we it's needed somebody happened. savage to host with us today. So we've got Randy with us. Oh, Randy. Yeah. Not not the Randy at the skate shop, but Randy. <laughs> the other Randy. The Macho King. That's right. Shout so, out to Randy at the skate hey, shop. Shout out to Randy at the skate shop. Yeah. Hey, man. I, I'm sorry it's my fault. I know you prefer Randall, but I got in the habit of calling you Randy because you work with my daughter and... <laughs> They just kind of picked up on it. My bad. No, it's okay. Because he's just like, this guy. He's savage. He's savage. <laughs> Randy yeah. is savage. All right, so today on Cake Turn Party, we're going we're gonna to watch some videos. Yeah. We've been doing a lot of skating lately. So we're going to, we, we, They've JD been doing has a discovered lot. his secret garden. Yeah. And Woo! we're going to go there right. and, and so watch a little bit of this that. This is, uh, AKA the, uh, what is it called? Slate Canyon. The Slate Canyon. Slate Canyon. There's few that know of his existence or how to find it. Ask Larry Brady. He and knows. JD yeah. has marked Rhett. the path with stickers so you know where to go. Randy, <laughs> go ask Rhett. Go ask Rhett. All right, here we go. Let's watch some ditching with JD. <laughs> ditching with JD. It's a work in progress, but it's oh, coming along. Look at that. Yeah. Leaf blowing, urinating. <laughs> Rhett's got a picture of him wall this riding. Is actually, that. This is actually not a bad ditch. It yeah. just needs some work. I mean, it hasn't been skated yeah. in See, I'll put 15 that years. In. It's kind of cur- It's Yep. Yeah. It's got some <laughs> curves at the top. Dude, I'll bring my leaf it's, blower and a push broom and we'll clean that fucker up. Yeah, you up. go down toward the end there and it's actually a small. Oh, and we could go paddleboard. <laughs> you! Look at it, JD. Man. It's kind of hard to skate, but it's. it's oh, fun. JD was ripping it, man. I, I was having a tough time. So there's this. JD dude was going off. I've been watching on Instagram called the Ratty Daddy. Have you ah, checked him out? I needed him to check him out. He yeah. rides all these cool little culverts and ditches, and he could have ridden that old four foot full pipe you were talking really? about. Really? Yeah, he, he's a cool guy. He's somebody we should. Trying to get on the show. Did you see that now. fakey three? Yeah, I did. <laughs> yeah, JD's got the moves. Look at that. Look at that to revert. Yeah. I mean, this is taking mixing back the back old with the, the new. 80s, yeah. Yeah. I think if Bob got down there, he'd get one of those old. I think I I think <laughs> back in the day I went there one time. Yet it stays wet a bunch. I I had never been there before. And it was that day. Well, I think it was the summer of '88. It never rained, and it yeah, was like exactly. it, it was just. I did a lot of skateboarding that summer. Really? That's one of my favorite little little triangle things right there, man. It's so much fun. There's, there's yeah, such that potential. Little, was, that little, was little cool. did the uh, local core of, of DOT engineers that put that together realize <laughs> what they were doing. Right. Yeah, J.D. And if you actually look at this on Google Maps, it says it's a creek. Yeah, which is which is that explains a lot. Yeah, I, didn't yeah. know it was, I just know it just it's like like, what, like the, the, the L.A. River, but in Maryville. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, 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 exactly. The Maryville River. Yeah. <laughs> Maryville River. Exactly. Woo! Can we start skating this up? in yeah. like '85? I think was when we finally some BMXers had found it. And tell me about now, it. It's you definitely guys, you not go looking for this. Be careful because there's a house right next to it, and yeah. the guy's got a gun. Yeah, he, it's not easy to find either. Yeah, it's 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 kind yeah, of yeah, Jay. Yeah. Bird approved. Yeah, what JD said. <laughs> yes, yeah, it's, it's a good. It's a Bertelman would like that. But yeah, like you say, Rhett has a picture of him doing a wall ride. Wall ride, yeah, from on the, from his old magazine. Yeah, uh, I mean, they, you know, they had a which we had on the show and talked about. Yep, yeah, exactly, exactly. This was part of the Ditch I, series in the eight, late 80s, late, 88. Uh-huh, I was uh-huh. going to say, 88, I think, is when I went there. Yeah. It was that summer that it never rained here. Yeah, it is. And because, you know, I rode the backyard half pipe, and it would get like a sponge when it would oh, rain. Oh, right. And it was super fast all <laughs> summer. And, yeah, and the thing was, with the half pipe in the backyard, it had like six layers of plywood yeah. on it, so yeah. it wouldn't it, dry out. It was like a, months. yeah, like I said, it was like a sponge. Yeah. Yeah. And, it, and it, was, it was so, I remember knee sliding on it, and like water would ooze out of it. <laughs> <laughs> but that was the summer that, like, it was it was so bad for the local environment or whatever, but it was so great if you were a skateboarder. Exactly, yeah. But that summer of 88 was awesome. Like I say, ditches are, they, you know, let's get back to your roots. <laughs> yeah. It ain't nothing but 
bones and tricks. <laughs> Something like that. Bitches. Look at that. Ah, yeah, JD. JD. Oh, nice. That's one of my favorite Shred. things there. Yeah. Heck yeah. And then I'm like, my, my two new friends. Yeah, those are our friends. These are our friends. So, so nice. there you go. Nicely done. This is JD Secret Garden. Talk to him. Give him 20 bucks. He might show you where it's at. <laughs> Shit, you don't need $20. You need a 12-pack of beer. <laughs> a 12-pack of what beer. kind of wheels were you riding there, Jay? Uh, soft, I was riding soft slides. Uh, huh? I, yeah, we were riding Rough soft riders. slides. I, I was riding... Well, just whatever. Well, yeah, I was I'm riding. I'm just asking what kind of wheels you were riding. I wasn't you riding... You I wasn't. Personal. I wasn't riding the new latest wheels I've got, which I love, the new Dragon Formula from Powell. Those wheels are awesome. So we, we, we've got a we've got a skate. Park we have an aging skate, skate park, and it's aging, and it's getting a little crusty. And I tell you what, those wheels make it worth riding again. It made I went out and rode them the other day, really hard for the first time, and um, it made our park fun again. So if you've got a park like ours that's ten years plus, that sits in the sun and the weather. <laughs> And has like where you get sand collecting by the the drain, and it's starting to go from gray to brown. Those are the wheels that you want to be riding. These are the wheels, believe me. I, I'm convinced. These There's guys, only one I'm problem. They only them. come in 56 and the, smaller. The 56 is we, the biggest wheel. If you're so like us, you need a 58, George, maybe a 60. 60 yeah. Stacy, if you guys are out there and you're watching this, 60s. Make yes, us some. Make exactly. us some 58s. I mean, I'll buy 58s, but I want the 60s. Take those wheels. And they're good wheel. I mean, they've got the rounded contour. Right. They're not totally square. You know so what? That, when COVID. SPS first came out, I loved the rounded ones. And I eventually yeah. moved to the taller square 60s. Right. And I really like those. They roll coping really well. Right, right. But I'll ride the round ones, man. Give me some oh, 60 the, millimeters. I mean, I and, and those, those things are great on smooth surfaces. But these things, rock, I mean, they would have been really good in that. Speed dish, Lab, right? yeah. if you're listening. <laughs> So I, I heard I, I'm, that, a, I'm a big Speed George, Lab supporter. That George Powell had been working on this urethane formula for like the last ten years. Good really? job, good and job. It took them forever, and they they ride smooth. They're and they're fast, only ninety twos, and they ride like one hundred one. Yeah. And they yeah. and they slide like one hundred ones. Wow! So if you're out there, you might want to try them out. And you know. George, Stacy, if you're listening to this, you might want to send me a few nuts. So, we want 60s. Exactly. So, yeah. Uh, so a lot of people ask us occasionally, you guys still skate? And as a matter of fact, you just saw us skating a little bit, but we also, not only skate dishes, we also skate some slalom. Why don't you bring up right. that little slalom video? <laughs> we, we Who skates slalom? I hate slalom. We, we skate slalom. We skate slalom. Shreddy. Shreddy Mercury. Yeah. yeah. Shreddy, Shreddy. Shout out. Shout out to Shreddy, man. You. So no, we not doing, only does he skate slalom, he skates slalom and makes it look fucking cool. So yeah. Start this, uh, run it back. Now, okay. Mike Lance there that you see in the run burgundy shirt. Okay, so we've been doing slalom Sundays over at Cherokee Farms, uh, Farms uh, over at UT and setting up cones because there's no traffic. Mike Lance makes slalom this look is, cool too. Uh, Mike Lance was the king of the day. Oh, yeah. He would have beat us all, period. Just zoom, zoom, zoom. And he's yeah. not even on a slalom board. He's yeah. on like a short He's on like a short a speed board, yeah. cross country yeah. board. Now, JD's got some slalom skills. Bob's got some <laughs> slalom skills. But look at Mike go yeah. on a not even uh, a slalom board. And JD, you're missing a few cones uh, there. I know, I know. <laughs> he's trying to keep up with Mike. <laughs> yeah. And look, he's not. He's not even shit. <laughs> but here, here's do do? Mike just zooming. We zoom, actually zoom. have a really good spot here in town for for doing slalom. No cars on the weekends, and it's a gradual downhill with perfect yeah. asphalt. And we bought extra slalom cones. I bought a fifty set of slalom. Yeah, lo cones. unfortunately, the weather's turned to shit here in Knoxville, <laughs> and so our Sunday sessions might be a little bit trimmed out. And here's me going really slow through the slalom cones. Looks like you got some water on the camera there. Was it raining? Uh, it was. So hey, uh, we also did a little slalom demo oh, uh, right. that Brian got us into uh, <laughs> over next one of the beer yeah, places. Yeah, I couldn't go to this. And there was Bob. We kind of all set the cones a little bit. Did a Let little slalom you, there. You really missed out on that. It was a lot of fun. <laughs> no, it was it was the most awesome <laughs> awesome slalom thing. Uh, a couple of skiers came out and watched us and went, "Huh, you guys are doing skateboards slalom." It was a, it was a skier event. Yeah, and they killed themselves on. Through inline skates. They they killed themselves. <laughs> they tried to ride inline skates and killed themselves. One guy tried well, to ride a skateboard and he about well, killed himself. Well, their first so. mistake was inline skates. <laughs> yeah, well, you know. They're skiers. <laughs> Fucking two planker wanker. Uh, exactly, exactly. 
So, <laughs> so that that was a little bit of us running some slalom. We we do ditches. We do slalom. We do it all here, baby, in Knoxville. <laughs> yeah, we got we it all going on. Yeah, we do. So, uh, not only that, we also we try to be scenesters. We try to get out there and we and try. if if it's try close enough within like. 10 hour drive or preferably like four hour drive <laughs> we try to hit some local events and yeah. uh, we've been good about the past couple of years but this year we were able to make it to rage at the rose inaugural first time that uh paul pulled off probably one of the best vert contests i've been into in yeah. years so it, it was my, so my well buddy, orchestrated yeah. and such a nice venue my, my good my good buddy uh, well my buddy paul guerrero uh, old uh, Huntsville local from Getaway, and they're building a new park. We'll have more Woo! on that in the next uh, couple of episodes. Uh, he has a massive acreage ramp compound. It's a, hor a horse farm with a freaking killer ass vert ramp that's that was built by um, Tim Payne. Uh, no, Skidmark. no, Skidmark. Uh, Skidmark. Oh, okay. And Skidmark they did an amazing job. Absolutely. It was so solid during the height of the session, standing on the rollout deck. It barely moved while Colin Graham was going head high out of the day, I think. <laughs> so we we went down for this contest. It's down. Uh, we camped. Ardmore. Because right. we're old and we're dedicated. Yeah. <laughs> and believe, for, you know, if you're young and you're camping, it's one thing. But when you're our age and it's camping, it's a And then you happen to mistakenly set up next to Team Pain. <laughs> That's right. We're looking at you, Team Pain. We're looking at you, Team Pain. <laughs> we set up to them, and about uh, 11 o'clock that night, Bunny and I drug the tent up the street and <laughs> camped somewhere else. And, and, uh, and uh, uh, um, um, Eli, Eli's uh, dad um, Eli's dad said, I just saw uh, he... He's an old hippie guy, and he's a cool guy. I've yeah. met him quite a few times. Uh, he said, I just saw a tent go running by. Well, we had left. We had a little LED lantern in the tent, so it was glowing blue in the middle of the night, and a blue tent floats up the road. <laughs> and it was me and Bonnie dragging. We're like, fuck this. And I was like, no, no. No, we, we can make it through tonight. We'll move tomorrow morning. And Jason's like, you can stay if you want, because I was going to sleep in the truck. He was like, you can stay if you want. And then... Let's move the fucking tent. <laughs> we move the tent. I move the truck, and then Jay. I, I couldn't move my tent, so I wanted. Jay, to Jay comes to me and he's like, "Hey man, you got one of those tarps?" <laughs> I, I wound up sleeping. I was gonna sleep in the orchard, but I wound up sleeping under the mini ramp instead. And it's wrapped up in video. a tarp. So we. This is the first video I've got. Day one, we're going there. We arrive, and then and day um, one's nothing like so what day two next, is. Next, next kick turn parties, we're gonna have. All the whole contest, wow. amazing footage from Colin Graham. The guy Dude, was going Cabbage. Shout to out to Cabbage was the MC. Thanks, Cabbage. Shout out to Peter Fernay who orchestrated and kept everything going. Shout out to Paul. I've got an interview yep. coming up with him that I've got. Uh, we've got recorded. Cabbage interview. We've got we've yep. got a whole bunch of stuff. We've got so much good footage. And We're just a little slow. I know you guys have probably been I'm a little in slow. A, inundated <laughs> with Rage at the Rose on Instagram and YouTube, but we've and got it's a not ton because I'm busy. It's because I'm mentally slow. <laughs> we, we've got a ton of good Rage uh, footage. So this. This is our first day. We're going to Rage at the Rose. You want volume or not? No. I want vol uh, no, just go ahead All anyway. Right, let's go. Hey, 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 welcome welcome to Kick Turn party. party! We're back on the road again for another episode. And on this episode, we're headed down to Ardmore, Tennessee to go to the Rage on the Rose. That's and right. our good friends, Half Pipe down there, he's got a big complex, got a mini ramp, got a full pipe. And we're going to be bringing you some videos from that and doing hey, some interviews. Isn't Cabbage going to be the MC here? Cabbage is going to be the MC. Our good buddy Cabbage, who we met in Kona, is going to be MCing. And we're going to go down there. We're going to have a great time. There's going to be talent from all over the country. Uh, they got a pro am contest. They got a women's division. They've got a kids division. Uh, I think there's a five thousand dollar purse. That, what's my division? Uh, the Gromit division. Grom. Grom. Old Grom. The old Grom division. <laughs> All right. Stay tuned. On the road again. I just can't wait to get on the road again. <laughs> this is where we encounter the cow. Yeah. Motherfucking dudes chasing a cow. Chasing a cow back to his pasture. And this is this is where we turned off there, and it became that was yeah. his whole land. So they had all these little 
cute little signs that had all these skate tricks. And apparently, it's, it's not funny. The Team Pain guys drew wieners. Penises and- on it. <laughs> oh, no. And they almost got kicked They off. almost got kicked off the property. Yeah. But what was even cooler was on the last night, Paul went and got all those signs and would hold it up and like body jars. The first guy that could do a body jar got the sign. Oh, that's right, cool. Right, so right, you got right. to take it home with you. I actually, in uh, future videos, I've got that guy uh, doing uh, eggplants. And it yep. said uh, fresh eggs. Fresh eggs. Yeah. And this is Paul. They were doing a little uh, uh, intro uh, for all the riders and everything. That's the guy that owns the complex. Great guy. Guy with the mic. Yeah. I ended up talking to him for a good five or ten minutes. They had and a- then Jay goes, you know that's the owner, right? And I had no idea. That's how cool the guy was. <laughs> and that was uh, they had they played the national anthem. They had a horse and show the and everything. Right there. And there's the mini. And ramp. what you don't see is up behind uh, where the the judges are standing and the MCs at up behind the ramp. That's an indoor horse arena. It's freaking nuts, man. Oh look, I'm wearing the same T-shirt. <laughs> Okay, you can turn. Um, yeah, uh, Eli, that's that Eli guy, the Eli kid. Didn't he just buy Twitter? Huh? <laughs> <laughs> Didn't he just buy Twitter? No, different that Eli. Was, so he, this, that was Elon. So this is Eli. just this is just a uh, Friday night this is the session, Friday night, session, open session. Friday night, open session. Open so session. We had just arrived. Go ahead. I, I had a camera, but. The battery was dead, and I didn't have any place to charge it, so I recorded everything with this, and I kept getting in the way of, like, the juice magazine. <laughs> and I was like, dude, where's your camera? And I went... <laughs> <laughs> so, shout out to Apple if you want to send us some iPhones. <laughs> you can get footage on our show! Exactly. That ki- I think it was that kid. He, I was standing up there, and, and he kind of laughed when somebody told me to get out of the way. And I, I said, I got a... I got a camera and I showed him the back with the kick turn party sticker and he went, oh, my dad loves you guys. <laughs> <laughs> That's right. But he uh, didn't. <laughs> so this is a, this is, this is Paul's big pole. Okay. <laughs> I, like, I like the way he holds it. <laughs> and so they were, they, this was once again, warm ups, and this is Colin, of course. And Colin Graham was uh, Colin, up. and yeah. this other kid from Embassy, the young kid, yeah. was ripping hard. God, that's huge! Well, there was that Look little bitty kid from Embassy. Yeah. Ah. Yeah. Well, but Colin like, was doing yeah, he was doing oh, meth, no, yeah. method errors yeah. to okay. fakey, and there's the seven judges, eight feet out, and uh, that guy on the end there, Ken Forsyth, Bob, if you're listening. Ken Forsyth was asking about you, <laughs> saying that oh, I miss that guy from the Bulldog Jams. Yeah. So Bob, he's a cool guy. Yeah, oh, nice. Yeah. yeah, there was. Those airs right in front of my face all night. It was unbelievable. Yeah, yeah. And not only that, but Colin Graham is a cool kid. Yeah. Oh, yeah. yeah. Really We've cool met him kid. a couple of times. We met him in Virginia Beach. Yep. Talked to him for a while with uh, Footage Della. to come. Yeah. <laughs> but, yeah, I, it was uh, it was about, I don't know, I guess it was halfway through or towards the end of night two, and I had a couple of kick turn party koozies left. <laughs> and I gave one to Colin, and I gave one to, uh, yeah. uh, oh, shit, I can't remember his name now. Went blank. Gonna have to cut that out. Yeah. Well, what is that kid's name? I don't know. know. There was a lot of kids there. No, my he's my favorite up and coming scary. We talked about him all weekend. I know. He's like my. The other kid was him at first. Yeah. I uh, love Terry Party stickers yeah. right there yeah. on the deck. And once again, this was kind of the warm ups the night before. We'll have more footage coming from the uh, uh, advanced division, the kids division. The Masters Division and the Pro Am Division in future Kick Turn Party episodes. So stay tuned. I've got some excellent, excellent killer yep. footage. That was a switch frontside rock and roll. Yeah. Yes, killer. exactly. And that ramp was perfect. Yep. Uh, oh, yeah. Oh, I, I rode it just for a little bit the, the morning. Of course, I didn't drop in, but <laughs> yeah. I rode on that thing. Yeah, and Buddy and I got out there and rode. There's the big ramp. There's the storm. Really? Going oh. out to take a pee in the middle of the night. Oh. <laughs> just... And so, there, there you have it. Uh, yeah. This is, that was the first part of uh, our adventures at Ardmore, Tennessee. And uh, thank you, Paul, for having us there. Yep. We're going to have more footage coming up. Great, great stuff. Yep. And um, 
We'll have that <laughs> on a future episode here coming up very soon. Uh, so I guess that's all we've got for this kick turn that's party. It. Yep. Yeah. Yeah. Thanks for stopping by. Yeah. Hey, send us some emails. It's kickturnparty at gmail.com. Follow and us on the IG. Yeah. <laughs> word, word. We'll have more footage of Colin Graham, other superstars. Uh, we've made new t-shirts. <laughs> and if you want to send me, you know, 30 or 40 bucks, I might send you a t-shirt. <laughs> Shit. Or I tell you what, just send me your email and I'll send you some stickers. <laughs> How about that? For free, even. <laughs> Thanks a lot for coming by Kick Turn Party. Appreciate you being here. Buy our stuff. Wait, we don't have stuff. <laughs> <laughs> send us some of your stuff. Yeah. <laughs> yeah exactly. Thanks a lot. Thanks for coming by. We're out. Keep trying, party. Woo! That's you. <laughs> Everybody's gonna hang out here tonight. All right. We'll pass out in the flat. All right. Tonight. We got nothing better to do than to take six runs, drink a dozen brews. Place else